Oh, that's right, baby. J-Rock is here. We're about to do this every Mortal Kombat fatality. Part one. All right. J-Rock saw this and he said, you know what? I'm going to do a series of this based on the uh, reaction response I get from you guys. So if you guys want J-Rock to do the whole thing, to do, you know, every Mortal Kombat fatality from the first Mortal Kombat to the Mortal Kombat 11, I need y'all to destroy that like button. Put in the comment section below that you want to see more of this. All right. But today I'm going to be doing reactions for Mortal Kombat, uh, the first one, the second one, and the third one. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to do the first three. All right. Come on back. Let's check this thing out. Hi, Lee. J Rock has come back to you, too. What is happening in the end, in the end with the millions <laughs> and millions of J Rock fans from all over the world? J Rock is here, and uh, we're about to check out uh, the first three Mortal Kombat games fatalities all right they got the whole they got every mortal Kombat ever all right but i'm gonna do just the first three games all right and this this will be part one and if you guys let me know you want more hit that like button comment down below let me know if you want to see more of these if so i will definitely continue on with this series all right but you guys gotta let me know and uh support your boy by hitting that like button hitting that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed all right i don't know what you're waiting for okay you are missing out on the most electrifying YouTuber in all of YouTubetainment. Okay? J-Rock. All right? Uh, if you got a reaction request, you got something you want J-Rock to react to, check out. Put a link to it in the comment section below. And if I choose your request, you'll get a shout out right here on the Great Ones channel. Now, without further ado, let's check this thing. Man, I remember that first Mortal Kombat. Y'all remember when the first Mortal Kombat came out? It was on the Sega Genesis on in the Super Nintendo. Remember that? The Super Nintendo wouldn't have let you have, have the blood. Didn't show the blood. But the thing about it was, is that the Super Nintendo version looked better, at least to me it did, than the Sega one. But the Sega one had the blood. You got to see the gore with, with Sega. I tell you, man, this game was so controversial. People were like, oh my God, you, you're letting people play this game? Are you not, like, I think it went to the Supreme Court. And I think that's where the whole, you know, you got to properly rate your games going forward sort of thing. Because this was the first game of its kind, if I'm not mistaken. Like, we had never seen a game like this. But his popularity grew so fast, like you can't hold down greatness. Why? Ice bomb. Mm hmm. Pussy! Oh! I remember the pit and the acid pool. But on the on, on part two, they brought back the blood. That was the hardest damn fatality, man. Like that damn fatality was hard as hell for me. The damn we cause you gotta time it right at the right to cut the head off. And wasn't no do-overs, like, you know, either you hit it or you didn't. Man, you look at how far we've come with graphics and realism. That was my favorite one right there. First time I saw this when I uh, at an arcade, somebody was playing. I was like, they got another one. Took like a year for it to come to consoles, though. They need to bring that one back. They need to bring that fatality back. Johnny Cage wins. Oh, and they got the they have some cold or something where you can punch it half three times. Here you go. 
Is this it? Yep, there it is. Damn! Shang Tsung. Boy, me and my friends, we will play this game. We going at it with the fatalities. It was hard with Shang Tsung because you remember we had to type in different type of commands. X, Y, A, B, up, down, hold up. The left trigger, the right trigger at the top in order to change into certain people. I had my list right there. I had it wrote down on a piece of paper. Okay, Jax. But then you had to remember all the moves we play. Oh, that's right. I forgot about news. All right, here we go, baby. Mortal Kombat 3. Kano. That's when they brought in running and the combos with it. Mm. Some of these I forgot all about. A lot of these fatalities don't seem nowhere near as bad compared to what we have now. Like the fatalities we got now, this is this is nothing compared to what we used to have. Or oh, compared to what we got now rather. Striker Sindel. I think that was my favorite one. I think. Parents were outraged when they saw this game. Like, well, don't buy it. I mean, unless the child got a job, a house, and a mortgage, they can't afford to buy this game. Oh. 
Now that I look back at a lot of these fatalities, a lot of them are just silly. Some of them are good, but some of them are just silly, you know? They need to bring that one back with a twist to it. Why he look like he gotta take a dump like this? Wins. Is this the ultimate one? I think so. See, like a lot of them are just silly fatalities. Or the same ones over and over. Like, how is he still making the noise when his bones are splattered out all over the place? Rain wins. Wins. Jacks wins. Kano wins. Yeah, I kind of lost track of them after the Ultimate Mortal Kombat because then they brought in so many different ones. Trilogy, Armageddon. Uh, yeah, a bunch of them. They did something with uh, DC. I just lost track of them. There was a, couple, there was a, um, a time period where I didn't play like hardly any video games for like a while. I want to say maybe from like, I don't know, 2002 to like 2007, 2008, somewhere around there. Like I didn't play video games for a while. Well, J-Rock says this. Um, nice going down memory lane. I remember a lot of these uh, fatalities like I said when you compare when you, you look at what we're, what's happening now with the games we have now fatalities back then that looks like child's play right and some of them just look silly to be honest with you but uh yeah yeah I'm looking I'm, y'all let me know if you want me to do the rest of this series all right I'm putting this out as a feel of the kind of feel of y'all feeling this all right uh no rhyme intended on that line y'all let me know You'll let me know by in the comment section and by destroying that like button. Alright? If this video can get anywhere between, I don't know, 20 likes, something like that, even more than that, then I'll do uh, I'll do part two and uh, we'll go from there. Alright? Post comments down below. Let J Rock know what you thought of his reaction to this video. No rhyme intended on that line. You enjoyed the Great Ones reaction? Then hit that like button, subscribe, and share. And be sure that you hit that bell so you can be notified when it is time to be electrified. Thank you for joining J-Rock. Until next time. Mamba, Gigi, and Wakanda forever. If you smell what J-Rock is cooking.